Analysis Elections 2018 Results Effects of Congress Winning Three States India Gets PM Candidate in Rahul Gandhi for 2019 Elections The November and December 2018 elections are being seen as a semi-final to the 2019 Lok Sabha elections, where the BJP is seeking a second term at the centre. The Assembly elections were held in five states. In 2014 Lok Sabha elections BJP defeated Congress party and after that Congress party lost many elections and Rahul Gandhi was criticized by majority people. Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh account for 65 seats in the Lok Sabha. In 2014 elections all three states supported fully to BJP and Narendra Modi. Now in 2018 these same states supported Congress President Rahul Gandhi which gave a new PM face for India, until now India was without a proper opposition leader or a competitor for the post of PM of India. In Chhattisgarh Congress won a clear majority, winning 68 seats in the 90-member House. BJP won 15 seats. Congress defeated BJP in Chhattisgarh where BJP was in power for three terms. In Rajasthan Congress won 99 seats in the 199-member House and BJP won 73 seats. In Madhya Pradesh Congress won 114 seats in the 230-member House and BJP won 109 seats. BJP ruled MP for 15 years and now Congress defeated BJP when BJP and many people thought that Congress is a dying party. Telangana TRS won 95 seats out of 119 seats, Congress won 21 seats and BJP won 1 seat. Mizoram MNF won 26 seats out of 40 seats, Congress won 5 seats and BJP won 1 seat. Now Congress will form government in three states namely Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh. The power of nota, the none of the above option on ballot paper or EVMs. The EVMs have the nota option at the end of the candidates list. The AAM My Party, AAP, which fielded its candidates on 85 seats out of 90 seats in Chhattisgarh, got 0.9% of votes while nota votes were 2.1% of the counted votes in the state. Samajwadi Party and Nationalist Congress Party, NCP, got 0.2% votes each in Chhattisgarh. The Communist Party of India, CPI, got 0.3% votes in the state. In Madhya Pradesh, NOTA votes were 1.5% of the total counted votes. Samajwadi Party got 1.01% while AAP got 0.7% votes. The NOTA votes in Rajasthan elections were 1.3%. The Communist Party of India, Marxist, and SP got 1.2% and 0.2% votes respectively. In Telangana Assembly polls, NOTA got 1.1% of votes while NCP got 0.1% of votes. The CPI, M, polled 0.4% votes while CPI received 0.4% votes. Before 2019 lower house elections, Congress party under the leadership of Rahul Gandhi gave a severe blow to BJP and PM Narendra Modi in elections by winning three states. Results in MP, Rajasthan, and Chhattisgarh are a testimony of the fact that it is not going to be a smooth run for the BJP in the Lok Sabha elections in 2019. The defeat clearly shows and proves that people have started to believe in Rahul Gandhi. Papu is becoming a real hero for Indians. After today, Rahul Gandhi is no longer the Papu of Indian politics. Now Rahul Gandhi may become Purampuchya for many Indians. The results clearly show that Modi wave has ended or on a brink of ending and wave of Rahul Gandhi is starting. Why BJP lost elections in five states? Following are the top reasons BJP lost elections. 1. Rifle scam. 2. BJP is not farmer friendly. 3. BJP is not doing enough for youth. 4. BJP failed to control oil prices. 5. BJP failed to control overall hike in prices all items. 6. BJP tried to bring Mandir issue but Hindu people are now interested in jobs not temple BJP needs to understand and let the Supreme Court of India decide what to do with that land.
7 note band program which became a black money exchange program. 8 RBI problems. 9 CBI problems. 10 no visible action on black money keepers. Union Finance Minister Arun Jaitla said issues in state elections are entirely different. The BJP won Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan and Chhattisgarh in 2003 but lost the Lok Sabha elections the next year, he said. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Tuesday congratulated the Congress party for its victory in the states of Chhattisgarh, Madhya Pradesh and Rajasthan and said that victory and defeat are part of life. BJP never thought that Rahul Gandhi can defeat BJP. The 2019 Lok Sabha elections will be now fought between the rising star Rahul Gandhi and current PM Narendra Modi.